Greetings everyone, Jim here from Storm Warning News. And could this be a dry run, this situation with the uh, balloons out of China, where there are anywhere from two to four or five of them out there right now, as these balloons could be called a top delivery platform for a nuclear EMP attack. Stand by for details. Now, high-altitude balloons, such as the one China has floated over Mountain State military bases this week, are considered a key delivery platform for secret nuclear strikes on America's electrical grid, according to intelligence officials, like spy balloons used by Japan to drop bombs during World War II. These now are far more sophisticated, can fly at up to 200,000 feet, evade detection, and can carry a small nuclear bomb that if exploded in the atmosphere would shut down the grid and wipe out electronics in a many state-wide area. And this is something I have been concerned about since this, uh, this information first broke uh, last evening. I didn't catch up with it till this morning. But uh, this is definitely a situation that we should be concerned about. You know, the Chinese did come out and say that these were a meteorological uh, device. Uh, they were also being used for science. I'm loosely paraphrasing here. But uh, we know that is not the case. And again, there is one that's right now, evidently, as of the recording of this video at 1.16 p.m. Eastern Time on the 3rd of February, is near Kansas City. That was the one that was uh, over Montana earlier. There's been, of course, reports of one over Canada. There's been also reports, uh, uh, again, I can't corroborate these, but over Hawaii and Guam, possibly even Antarctica. This is a very interesting situation, and I wanted to show you this. This is a blue paper that was published by the American Leadership and Policy Foundation that uh, explains that novel high-altitude delivery platforms for weapons of mass destruction, weapons of mass effect. Uh, I'll run through just a little of this here. Can a state, pseudo-state, or non-state actor deliver weapons of mass destruction? Uh, to st strategically impact America's infrastructure, absent employment of intercontinental ballistic missiles, ICBMs. This goes on to talk about this type of uh, situation we are dealing with today and have been for the last couple of days with these balloons that China has floated over uh, America. This is a situation we need to keep an eye on, my friends. Uh, as far as an EMP, this could be a dry run for it. Who knows? This could be something that will wind up being an EMP today, later on, or even tomorrow. Uh, things, I believe, have taken a, a turn today. And at this point, I really mean it when I say be expecting anything and be surprised by nothing. Be as prepared as well as you can, not only physically, but mentally, spiritually, emotionally, uh, and psychologically for the, uh, the prospects of a, a major grid down situation due to an EMP. Not saying it's going to happen. It is a strong possibility. And most of all, be pressing into Jesus. Be right with God, my friends, because these are the end times and anything goes at this point. Know who your Savior is. His name is Jesus Christ. I will leave you a link to this um, th this piece if you want to look through it. Please like this video. Please subscribe. Please share. Hit that bell icon for notifications of new uploads. This is Jim signing off. Until the next time, God bless you.